Hey, my pretties, welcome back. So I am in front of Cardenas, which is the Mexican market. Um, the kids are bugging me. They just called me like, both of them, they're like tag teaming me, talking about, mom, go get some tamales. Go get some tamales. Why well, I feel like my lip gloss look, oh, it was extra shiny right there in that corner. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Getting attacked by bugs. <laughs> So I'm gonna run in here right now. I haven't been in here. I did film in here one time for you guys. I haven't been in here in a minute. Um, but since I'm going in, I might as well get me some ceviche because I love their um, ceviche, the spicy one with the green. Oh my goodness. I forgot what it's called right now. Um, I know the name too, but it's, it's on the tip of my tongue. But we're gonna go in um, Cardenas right now. If you haven't seen this uh, Mexican grocery store, uh, it's really cool. They have all kinds of stuff in here. Um, the sign is, yeah, I'm already parked, so I can't show you the sign. <laughs> but let's go in here. Look at that. They even have jewelry right there. Okay, so they have the salsa and the sitting area over there. If you guys get, if you order food, because you can order hot food and sit over there to eat. I need to go this way to the... I would get a bumpity basket. Oh my goodness. I need to go over to where the fruits and vegetables is first. Ooh, Tropical Passion? Stella Rosa, what is that? Tropical Passion flavored brandy. I didn't know uh, Stella Rosa did that. I just thought they had wine. Shows you how much I know. They have honey peach. Honey peach flavored brandy. That's what that looks like. Wow, very interesting. I want to try this. <laughs> I think I want to try this. I'm getting this. See, I ain't even come here for that. Okay, now I know I don't want this basket because it got the bumps. But I don't know if I feel like running back outside to go try to get another cart. I think I am. If it was just me shopping and not talking to you guys, I would I would deal with it. But hold on, here's a basket. Let me see. Maybe we could swap it out. Oh yeah, you don't even hear that one. Okay, so this one was sitting right here. We're gonna sit that one right there. And then we got this one. Okay, they got some plums. Um, I'm gonna get probably three they have some peaches right there and some nectarines i'm gonna probably get three of each to see how sweet they are before i just go crazy buying them up and then i don't like them i'm gonna grab two tomatoes because since i'm here i figure we're gonna do taco night uh, not that one okay these two they're 99 cent a pound One of my favorite things about this store is that you could come over here and get you a fruit salad and look at all of that. I'm not gonna get one today. I normally would, but I'm gonna pass today. And they always have all kinds of cakes and stuff and goodies. Got that. This good looking salad, $7.99. And knowing we don't need no more cake or cupcakes in my house. My daughter's 18th birthday was the other day. As a matter of fact, thank you guys to all of you. That's cornbread. It's heavy too for $7.50. Um, thank you for all of you guys. Well, hold on, hold on. I wanted to do it the right way. Thank you to all of you guys that um, gave all the happy birthday wishes to my daughter. You guys be having me smelling. Thank you for loving on me, loving on my kids and everything like that. But we're not gonna get mushy in the middle of the grocery store. But I did wanna say thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm gonna cheat. I'm gonna get the shredded lettuce for the tacos so I don't have to shred it. Let's get this one in the back. The cute little jello containers. Right there, you got the panda bear. And the last time I was here, I showed you guys, they always have a bunch of pinatas. Look at all that. Is that Mario Brother? I think that is. <laughs> but yeah, they have lots and lots of um pinatas there's mickey mouse right here 149 for that bag uh 149 a pound of course 
everything is always nice and fresh in here i love it i don't know why sometimes i tell myself to just come here and do my grocery shopping but i always end up going um closer to home but i do i really love shopping here we got some honeydew some cantaloupe Okay, what are these? And I always end up seeing something I don't know what it is. I'm I wanna that's not tamarindo, is it? I don't know. I can't read that. I'm not too sure. But they have that. They have these spiky things. I know some of you guys know what it is and you ooh those spiky. I love looking at stuff I ain't never seen. Got those. Oh, I thought those was loquats. They're called tio, tiocate, tiocote. I don't know. Something like that. Strawberry fresquita. Sparkling agua fresca. So sparkling water. You got strawberry, apple. These are 179. Orange, grapefruit, and pineapple. I think I want to try the strawberry and the apple. Okay, so let me grab some ground beef. We got all the cheese, cause the ceviche and the tamales and all that is on the opposite side of the store. Tilapia, 842 for that. 1223. All the cheese down there. I usually come here to get my cotija when we do, um, when me and the kids make our elote. I come here and get my cheese, but I'm looking for ground beef. The packs of chicken is looking real nice. Look at them big old legs for $5.66 for that pack. Them legs is nice and thick too. $17 for that pack. And a pack of thighs is $8.59. Pork ribs strip, that's this is $6.88. $8.76. See what I mean? Meat looks good. Everything is fresh and they have good prices here. Chuck roast. $26. And you get three chuck, you get three of them. Not bad. Not bad at all. Beef chuck, 10.05. Let me see what the steaks is looking like. This is T-bone, two of them for 13.43. I don't see any ribeye right now. Um, they might be behind the um, glass over here because the butcher area is over here. Look at that. They got little flowers on the cheat on the crema. It's sour cream. So they have different creams over here. This one has salt in it. Okay, I think the ground beef is over here. Yep, right here, $3.49 a pound uh, for 73 cent, 73% uh, or 85% is uh, $4.49. And look at this, this meat counter goes way, 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 way down there. Once you get towards the end, you have the fish and stuff, but I mean, it's pretty pretty long. You guys, I was just standing here waiting my turn because you know, they working with the customers. I didn't know that they that you were supposed to pull a, um, a number. So I was just standing here wondering why everybody was going in front of me. <laughs> Finally got my number. Okay, so we got the ground beef. I got three pounds and it's $14. Chicken fajita seasoning. I have a thing where I'm always looking at seasonings. I need to stop chicken seasoning down at the bottom i don't think i need any of those hot and spicy cracklings or you can get some pork rinds oh okay it was chicken down here they got chicken feet whole chickens beef feet uh beef tendons tripe you got beef tongue so there's, they have a lot of stuff. And then the seafood was down here. Is that catfish? It sure is. 
catfish nuggets, only $1.99 a pound. That is not bad. <laughs> not bad at all. Okay, let me see what the eggs look like here. 18 count is $7.99. So that's these right here. Woo, that's a lot. $7.99. You got the 12 count for $5.50. And this tray, 20 count, is $8.99. Okay, I'm almost down here to where the ceviche and all the other stuff is. Cheese over here, more cheese over here. Pozzoli, that's hominy. Uh, uh, this is masa for tamales, so it's already prepared for you. They even have it in pink, it's strawberry, strawberry dough. And then that one is pineapple. Let me grab some sour cream. Ooh, the guacamole is $6.50. But I have to get it because it's so good. And it's made fresh. They make it fresh back here in that middle area right there so i'm gonna get that even though that's a bit pricey and i love their um pico de gallo so this is 4.49 i'm also gonna grab that okay they have out some banuelos um i just i hate that they only make them round like this they used to do it to where it was like in triangles like little chips but you can only get them like that now what is this? That's a banuelo as well with sugar cane. Oh, I want to get these, but I just, I mean, I could break them up too. That's probably what I'll do and just put them in a Ziploc bag. Fresh tortilla shells. Grab those. Okay, now this right here is the tamales. I know it's tamale, like you when you said it's tamale, but I, I just be I be lazy with I be like the tamales. <laughs> Six count thirteen forty nine or for one is two twenty nine and they have a bunch that you can choose from. Look at that, it's hot in there too. You have jalapeno. Sorry if the camera is getting foggy. Jalapeno. That one says something jalapeno cream. Ooh, -wee. look at my camera. Okay, let me step back. And then down there, um, I just gotta find the chicken, the chicken and the beef ones. I gotta go on the other side. And that's beef and that's chicken over there. And I love that they're wrapped um, individually. You can get them like that as well, but I'ma grab, I'ma grab a couple of the beef and a couple of the chicken for the kids. Okay, so this one in here is a lote. Um, that's a sweet corn. And we've tried that before, but it was it was too sweet. It was like a dessert. Um, I decided to try one of the jalapeno ones. It just says um, jalapeno, um, that one, jalapeno and cheese and crema. So I'm gonna try one of those, but I got the beef and the chicken already down here. And I am right here next to the ceviche. So they have the, they have it prepackaged for you, or you can have them give it to you it's actually down at the end but this is all the different sauces that they have and everything is made fresh I'm not sure what this is oh wait chicken breast salad crab salad so all the different ceviches over here that's what I was trying to say when I was saying the spicy one I like the agua chile right here the green one so I'm just gonna grab one down here that's already made. I don't know if I want a big one or a small one. I usually go with this big one right here. And it's $9.99 a pound, and that would be that that one will be $20 or $18.88. So I'ma get me a small one. <laughs> and that's still $10, but it's definitely worth it. Oh yeah, she loves the rice right here, but these bags are $30. So what I'm gonna do is just get one of these. Cause really between me and her, we'll probably be the only two that'll eat these. I mean, eat this with our tacos on the side. So I'll grab that. 
they do have refried beans but i already got some refried beans at home chili verde pork green chili hmm have you guys ever seen big pork uh pork rinds like this look at that i showed it to you the last time i was here how big is that Woo. it's nine well ten dollars They have the uh, base that I like to use when I make my um, kidney beans and my rice with my sazon. Oh, I'm getting this, $3.79. I haven't made that for the kids in a while. So what I do is I just take my kidney beans in a pot with some sazon and I put this in there and I kind of cook it all together. And then I make a pot of rice, this one right here. And then I make uh, you can do this one or that one. Um, I make a pot of rice and I add this coloring to the rice and then you take your beans that you had that you had simmer down and put the bean the kidney beans because um, once you simmer it down with this and the sazon it's gonna be kind of like um, almost like a like kind of thick so you can put your beans on top of your rice and they love that so we already have some sazon at home so I'm gonna grab this because I haven't seen one of these in my local grocery stores in a while. I learned that from my big mama, who is one of my best friend's moms. And um, she was Puerto Rican. So I don't know if that's like a Puerto Rican dish, like taking the beans, cooking it down with the sazon and uh, cilantro base, and then putting it on top of the rice. I don't know, I, I know my big mama made it. So um, I, I wanna say it's Puerto Rican. I don't know. <laughs> I have to call her and ask her. like. Big Mama, did you just make that on your own or is that a, a Puerto Rican dish? Or if any of you guys know if it is or if it's not, just let me know. That's cute. We have some more over here. Love those pictures up there. The colors are really, really pretty. Okay, I'm looking for some tortilla shells so I can eat with some of the guacamole. I'm only seeing uh, those right there. I gotta go to the row where they have chips. Okay, I'm following him. He taking me to the chips. <laughs> okay, he sat down here. Let's see. Oh yeah, okay, I want these. Ooh, my kids used to eat these all the time from the ice cream truck. They would come around and they would um, squeeze a uh, lime on it and some chamoy and my kids will be out there tearing them things up <laughs> okay the deli section over here i think i have enough cheese at home but just just in case i'm gonna get this one okay you guys i think that's it for today in here um i picked up too much stuff already i got a lot of stuff in my basket but um, yeah, I can't wait to try the brandy. I ain't gonna lie. I wanna try that and see what that tastes like. Honey honey peach? Oh yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna get up here to this line and I'm gonna get out of here. I stopped right here because I don't wanna go in the middle and everybody be looking at me like, what is she doing with this camera? So um, I thank you guys for watching uh, and I'll see you guys real soon in my next video. Okay, bye. Okay, fine. So the total came up to 136.82. Just so you know. <laughs>